All right, so in this video, we're going to go over WordPress themes. And within the appearance section of the WordPress dashboard, there's a lot of flexibility, a lot of different options in there. And we can add themes, which you can think of as almost like a template, as you saw earlier within this series, if you've been watching it. I changed themes from 2017 to 2019. And there are thousands of these themes, both free and paid or premium themes, if you want to call them that, that are available. So let's go over how to add a theme, how to select good ones, and cover both free and premium themes and show you which ones I recommend. So let's dive into that now. All right, so when we're back here in the dashboard, we can go to Appearance and Themes right here, and it will show us what theme we have as our default theme. Right now, I have the current theme as the 2019 theme. And if we want to, we can go and add a new theme to the site. And there's going to be a similar look to this as we saw with the plugins that we just went over recently. It will say popular, latest, favorites, and you could search for themes over here. So let's say you wanted to look at the popular. You're going to have a lot of pretty good themes in here. These two right here are two of my favorites that I would recommend, Ocean WP and Astra. I actually have links to them on my site, WPWithTom.com, if you do want to check them out further. And I'm going to be doing some little reviews on some of these themes as well. And then if we scroll down here, there's some other good ones as well. One of my favorite ones is actually called Generate Press. And if you search up here, there it is. I saw it coming up. Generate Press right here. And you can preview the theme. You can see that it has 864 ratings. And it has almost a perfect five stars when you look at it. Let's just say we want to go back. I'm going to X right here. And then if you wanted to, let's just say install this one, you can click install on it and then hit activate. Now, with those themes that I just mentioned, Ocean WP, Astra, and Generate Press, those are probably my three themes that I would most recommend at this time. And with them, they all have a free version and a paid or a premium version. They have different costs associated with them. Of the three, I believe Generate Press is probably the best value. And in my opinion, I would say it's probably coded slightly better than the other two, but they are all very clean code and well done, well made themes. I just personally like Generate Press, and that's what I use on my own website as well. So if you wanted to go and delete this one that we're no longer having as the active theme, we can click on Theme Details and Delete. And then to confirm it, you just click OK. And now we're left with just this one. Now we only can have one theme active at a time. That doesn't mean we can't add other themes. So if we went over here and we went to popular, let's just say we want to install this one for Ocean WP. We wanted to install Astra, these two other free themes that are also awesome themes. We don't have to activate it yet. See, they're not activated. And if we went back over to appearance themes here, we can see that the active one is Generate Press, and these ones are not active yet, but they're available to be active. Now, I personally like to only have one active theme here and get rid of the ones that I'm not using, but I just wanted to show you that you can have more than one there at a time. So part of the reason why I like each of these themes is they come with starter sites or demos that you can create a website based off of, and they give you a lot of flexibility. Now again, you can go through WPWithTom.com and I have more information about these themes and there's actually links to them in the description as well if you wanna check them out for yourself. But there's lots of different starter sites or templates or themes or demos that you can get started very quickly and have a great looking website up in just a matter of minutes with, with one of these themes. So that's a big part of why I like them. They're clean coded, they're fast sites because of the clean code, and they're easy to use with builders as well, such as Elementor or Brizzy, Beaver Builder. So there's a lot of flexibility built into them. They have free and premium versions, and you can just do so much with them with the starter sites and get websites up quickly. I hope that I was able to share with you a little bit of why I like these themes and what you should look for in a theme. As far as they go, you can always see the ratings they're getting, as I showed you when you previewed generate press here you can see and learn more about the themes themselves you can also see a live preview if you were to click on it as well and then you get an idea of what you're getting into 
before you actually install the theme. Now it is going to be blank and pretty bare bones, but you can get, it, get an idea if you play around with it as well. So I'm going to just go and X out of this. And next I'm going to dive into the Appearance Customize section here. And then we're going to get started with customizing our website.